It was during the early decades of the 19th century that the structure of atoms was coming into focus. It was known, for example, that a hydrogen atom contained one proton and one electron. But the scientists of the time could think of no stable arrangement of the two particles. It was known that a proton and any atom were grouped in a small central region called the nucleus, and that the electrons were somehow arranged in comparatively large distances outside the nucleus. But in hydrogen, if the electron were stationary, it would fall into the nucleus since the charges on the particles would cause them to attract one another. Yet the electron couldn't be in orbit circling the nucleus either. Circular motion requires consistent acceleration of circling body to keep it from flying away. But the electron has charge and charged particles radiate light when they are accelerating. So an electron in a circular orbit would radiate light and would spiral into the nucleus.